Good morning, wonderful, beautiful buddies. I know it doesn't really look like morning, but we caved and we brought our little air conditioner and put it up in the window because it's supposed to be hot the next couple days. I just paused Navi. Navi was doing her little job this morning, vacuuming up the house. Yeah, we caved and put the AC back in because we have a bunch of people coming over tonight for what I was telling you guys the other day about game night slash anniversary party night. And it's like almost 78 inside the house. And then we were gonna play in the basement, but the basement's not really set up to play. So we caved and Jamie put the, the little air conditioner that he can pick up by himself. This is the air conditioner we used to use until we bought the bigger one. This one actually keeps like this room cool and that room cool, but not really the rest of the house. The big one did good for the whole house. I think the dogs are happy that it's back in. Yeah, I know, you guys were getting warm. I was actually more worried about them than I was everybody else coming over tonight. <laughs> yeah, is that good stuff? All right, let's get prepped. So one of the things we're making for game night tonight is cheesy hash browns in the crock pot. And it got me thinking, you guys have been asking us for a long time to do more cooking stuff. And I've kind of sort of been tossing around the idea of doing a separate channel where I would do like w at least one cooking video a week and then maybe like a cooking tip, like some type of product that makes cooking for me easier or something like that. But I don't want it to be like a fancy cooking channel. Like I don't cook fancy. Jamie and I cook on a budget and we cook, you know, I call it normal food. Normal food, home style food. That's the word I'm looking for. So we cook a lot of home style food and I'm not a very good cook, but, and this is kind of why I wanted to start it. I'm not a good cook. I don't think I'm a good cook anyway. Everybody else likes my food, but <laughs> um, I've never been good at cooking. So in the 20 years Jamie and I have been together, I've learned a lot and I've learned a lot of ways to do things easy and make food taste good. And I know that a lot of people that watch maybe don't cook or have never cooked or want to learn how to cook. What do you guys think if I actually started another channel where we did cooking? And it would be like everything, like we would do main dishes, side dishes, desserts, snacks, like and I could have playlists for all of them. Kind of thought a lot about it and just haven't really pulled the trigger yet. Uh, let me know what you guys think and also what would you call it? Because that's the other problem I'm having, I have no idea what to call it. I mean, not like I need another YouTube channel. I don't really want to put them on here because I kind of want to do it as a separate thing. Um, but anyway, give me some suggestions. But well, right now, we're going to make cheesy hash browns in a crock pot. There's my hash browns. They're going to go in here with a bunch of good stuff. First, chop up three cloves of garlic and then fry it in a pan. You can also add a small onion, but I don't really like onions, so I'm just doing garlic. While that's mixing together, we're gonna get everything else ready. We need 32 ounces of refrigerated hash browns. These are actually dehydrated, but I turned them into this. One can of cream of mushroom soup. You can also use cream of chicken soup or a different type of cream of soup. If you don't like mushrooms, you can substitute this out for something else. Two cups of sour cream and three cups of cheddar cheese or cheese of your choice, really, and then some salt and pepper. And what I'm gonna do now is once this stuff is done frying up and has that nice translucent-y color, which this smells amazing, but I love garlic, I'm gonna take all of this stuff, put it in here, mix it together, and stir it all together, put it in your crock pot, and cook it on low for about five hours, and it's done. It's super easy. It's a really easy side dish to make, or you could even add ham to it if you really wanted to, and now it's like a breakfast dish. <laughs> Hmm, which dog do you think is most excited that the air conditioner's back? Well, Oakley's pretty close, but then there's this dog. Does that feel amazing? Is that the greatest thing ever? <laughs> You're so cute. I think the dogs are enjoying the warm weather. I really think the dogs are enjoying the AC that you put back in the window. I don't know if you saw Memphis earlier, completely upside down belly in the air right next to it yeah, yeah. I, it. I think that they're enjoying that right now they're enjoying the shade notice how none of them are in the sun well it's not like a super hot day there's still a cool breeze yeah and the sun is enough to warm me up it's, it's perfect it's perfect it's a little sunny I was say it's perfect except it's like 15 degrees too warm for yeah, me yeah yeah look nice? at it. look at you girls I'm going to have to find out what the pool temperature is. Ooh. Are you going to get in? <laughs> Come with me, thermometer. Ooh, it says it's 90 in the shade. Ugh, yuck. Does that really work? Yeah, it's going down. It's not 90. 
It's not 80. Maybe it is 80. I don't think the water is 80 degrees. No, it started at 90 in the sun. Get Maybe more, it is. Get some more cold in there. Oh, see, it's going down. Huh. Interesting. I mean, I guess it could be 80. It's going to feel colder because our body temperature is warmer than that. The, the air that's stuck in there right now might be actually that warm. Huh. I can't believe it's 74. Yeah. I guess it could be, though, because, yeah. I mean... But that's gonna be like you know 20 degrees colder than what what our body temperature is so it's gonna yeah. feel cold i'll have to get another thermometer but yeah it says it's about 74. i have a digital one want to try it i think we might have to okay i'm gonna go grab it okay. watch this will be funny they're all watching me and as soon as i open this door i don't have to say anything look at that they made liars out of me none of them moved good stay here i'm coming back out so we're using the candy slash meat thermometer yeah, and it's, it's hard to tell that but it is on, that's the surface of the water so yeah, it is it it's is underwater, underwater. it says it's 74 degrees yeah, the water is 74 that's pretty cool that's huh. crazy that is crazy Oops, you know, 73 it definitely makes me want to get in it makes you <laughs> makes you wonder is this like waterproof i don't think it's fully waterproof i mean it is a candy Let's thermometer but what i paid like 20 dollars for that i don't really know how much i paid for it yeah, Pretty sure it's waterproof. 74 down there. <laughs> Memphis is like, quick, throw me in. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're not throwing you in, honey. <laughs> She's like, whoa, <laughs> hey, <laughs> you're dripping water out. What's going on, Shelby? There's there's nobody at the chair yet. The only thing up there is your daddy's drink. There's nobody at the table yet. Are you just preparing? She's like, I have my position for game night. This is where the food gets dropped. <laughs> is that what you're doing? Are you preparing? <laughs> You're funny. Shelby, who's here? Big Chop Chop! She's like, wait. wait Bye -bye. I know that Jeep. Who is it, Shelby? Who's here? Shelby? Bye -bye. Yeah, is it Greg? <laughs> She's such a riot. Uh, I think Greg is here. Pretty sure he's out there. You can't see him just yet though, he's got to bring in stuff, like a cake. <laughs> what? Uh, all that noise before you even make it in the door. What? She's like, I know you. Shelby says you smell like cake. <laughs> I got to show you guys what Greg brought. Greg brought fun things. I got to show you. Try that. Yeah. Look, Greg made a cake. It's technically, it's a cake for Jamie and I's anniversary. Thanks for making us cake, mm -hmm. Greg. That was really fun. It looks really good. I'm ready for cake. I think it is. Forget everything else. Let's just eat the cake. <laughs> I just smell that the whole way here. Oh. It smells like chocolate fudge and m &M. This m, m isn't going to make it. I'm going to eat this one. <laughs> so Greg just showed up. Girls just had their lunch. And I guess everybody else is coming over pretty soon for game night. And I know I've said this before, but if you guys are ever interested in the different games we play during game night, I do have an affiliate link from Amazon with all the different games that we have and pretty much all of them that we play during game night. We play Catan, Disturbed Friends, Cards Against Humanity, Quartz. There's a whole bunch of different games we play. Just depends on how many people show up because some games you can play with more and less people. I think we have six people total showing up today. Well, look at you. You're just sinking into the couch over here. Tongue sticking out. Your tongue, your tongue, your, your tongue is sticking out, Shelby. Your, your tongue's still sticking out, honey. There you go, you fixed it. This dog over here is just out. Oh, you woke up. You heard me picking on Shelby, huh? Yeah, I think you did. Memphis is sleeping. She's down, down in the hallway, kind of sleeping. She's just chilling down there. We are getting ready to go to bed. Uh, game night was fun. I didn't film anything because that tends to happen on game night. Sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. This time around I didn't really film much. But yeah, it was fun. We had a good time and now we are off to bed. So as always, if you are new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again 
soon. Memphis in the hallway. Uh, good night, party. Oh, that's a big yawn. Yeah, I know, I'm tired. You got lots of pets, though. You all got lots of attention. That's why you guys like game night, because you get all kinds of extra attention. And certain people feed you. I don't know who those certain people are, but they definitely feed you. <laughs> uh, good night, audience. Thanks for liking and subscribing to Snow Dogs Vlog.